This is Extreme Conventions. I promise I wasn't going to cry through my daughter's wedding. Where do you go to see grown men cry? Try Albuquerque, New Mexico, home of the most tear-jerking convention on Earth. This is the National Fiery Food Show, the biggest, spiciest, most sweat-inducing chili pepper convention in the country. Yay! Fire Eaters Unite! We drove all the way down here from Seattle, 1,800 plus miles, to come to the biggest gathering of chili heads in the world. Every March, some 14,000 chili choppers gather here to worship their favorite fiery fruit. Even the chili pepper police have traveled here all the way from Germany. In the morning, we put it in the coffee. In the evening, we're drinking hot chocolate with chili in it. And chili beer, of course. <laughs> this is chili land. This is for the people who love chilies. With 200 exhibitors representing 40 states and five countries, this is the only convention where you can sample and buy more than a thousand chillified products. Everything from sauces to candies contains chilies. So you want to try the cayenne caramel? That's this little guy right here. This homage to hot stuff was started in 1988 by chili lover Dave DeWitt, who decided the potent pepper deserved its own convention. And now it's become the place to showcase all the newest and most blistering hot sauces. Habanero hot, hot, hot. World's best hot sauce. That's my hot sauce. Pride of the show as far as I'm concerned. Alpha Science says the best, best barbecue best sauce, sauce in the world. Best sauce in the world. Not a game. One thing you'll discover, everybody claims to have the best sauce at the convention. So before you buy, of course you gotta try. And with free tastings at most of the booths, you could sample hundreds of sauces over the course of the weekend, if your tongue can take it. Come on, try the Flamin' Joe's. It don't hurt none. I go for the hottest stuff, the new stuff. I'm walking around crying, tears in my eyes. Yep, the fiery food show can reduce even the toughest guys to tears. And that includes cops. I, I, I can't see, I can't hear, I can't hardly talk. I promise I wasn't gonna cry through my daughter's wedding. Who's got the sauce that makes the police weep? A fireman, of course. Meet Jim and his special sauce called Stupid Hot. I had some police officers come over. They thought they were pretty tough. They wanted to try my hot stuff, and so I gave them a sample of my Stupid Hot. I can't feel myself. That is the hottest thing I've ever had in my life. And they found out very quickly that they weren't all that tough. <laughs> I'll never do that again, trust me. We can go home now. OK, I'm done. Go home? But we're just getting warmed up, because we're taste testing another of the show's most sizzling sauces. Who wants to try mongoose? That's the hottest chili in the world. It's a slow ride. Brace yourself for the mongoose, a sauce made from the hottest pepper in the world, the boot jalokia from India. And it's making its debut at this convention. Now you got to swallow. I can't feel my tongue. <laughs> The effects of severe chili burn might be hard to describe, but there's actually a scientific way to measure it. The Scoville scale. A bell pepper rates zero Scoville units. A jalapeno pepper measures about 3,000. A habanero is 250,000. And the boot jalokia, one million. It burns your ears. Okay. Your head feels like it's gonna explode. You get kind of stoned, a little bit high. And then you come down slowly, and then you come back and buy it. <laughs> a lot of people believe that people can get high from chili because chili peppers do release endorphins in your body. That may explain why so many people are drawn to the fiery food show. They're all looking for the ultimate chili high. The chemical that creates that signature burn is called capsaicin. When nerve endings in the mouth detect capsaicin, they send pain messages to your brain, which responds by releasing endorphins, the body's natural painkiller. And when the endorphin gets there, it says there's nothing wrong. The moron ate hot sauce. Okay, so the endorphin says, well, we're already here. Let's just have some fun. Okay, then it starts dancing around, and then you get the rush. Much like a runner's high, this endorphin rush can create a feeling of euphoria. 
But it's not all bliss. There can be some scary side effects, too. God bless you, and enjoy the ride. I've seen people actually fall down, turn white, and pass out. They used to have paramedics on the premises all the time because some people just can't handle it. And we recommend you follow one new rule. No chugging. Ultra hot sauces should be tasted responsibly on a very small stick. And that's how John Dilly of DEFCON must deliver his dangerous goods. Self-proclaimed genetic alchemist, weaponizer of peppers, John's a finance guy from New Jersey with one goal, the most sadistic sauces known to man. I started making the sauces about 15 years ago. Over a couple of beers about five years ago, a guy goes, a friend of mine, hey, why don't you start up a company? Now in his fourth year at the convention, John's taste testing his hottest sauce yet, the DEFCON Zero. Prepare yourself. It's not for the faint of heart. If you don't like hot stuff, stay home. I ain't a beard. I ain't a beard at DEFCON. Let's do this! DEFCON! Welcome to the dark side, dude. Thank you, man. Look at that. That is not much. It's going to wreck me, dude. DEFCON! Good luck, friend. The DEFCON Zero is made from the orange habanero pepper. It may only measure around 250,000 on the Scoville scale. But don't let that fool you, because the DEFCON Zero isn't made from ground up chilies. It's made from extract, meaning this little bottle contains the equivalent of 10 pounds of habaneros, giving it a rating of up to 2 million units on the Scoville scale. What does that feel like? Every pepper spray? Three, two, one. My lungs are burning. My mouth is burning. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Oh. Woo! It burns. Kick you right in the testes, man. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I'm dying over here. I, I ain't kidding. It's, it's brutal. Woo! Oh, I'm sweating just oh, watching you. Yeah, that's good stuff, man. Um, it's not. Oh, don't mess around with it, though. We could kill small children. <laughs> Your name is Nick. Nick! Yeah. Oh, wow. They start laughing, crying, wheezing. And I love my job because I get to watch. <laughs> Whoa. Take yep. another one, Tim. I'm not taking another one, dude. I'm hurt bad. Don't bother going back for seconds. You'll be feeling the burn for a while. DEFCON Zero can last over a half an hour. It goes more? Oh, you're not done? Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> wow! Think roller skating's just good, clean fun? Not here it ain't.